Welcome, this is your Option Monster Volatility Sonar Report. From the Florida SIBO, this is Jamie Tyrrell of Group One Trading. Well, this is our last day of VIX trading in July, and if the morning is any indication, the market believes that it's going to go out with a whimper. Uh, the market is down slightly right now. It was up in the morning. Uh, Bernanke spoke just after the open, said he believes the economy is getting better. Uh, but we've been drifting downward into slightly negative territory. So that means the VIX is up slightly, VIX futures up slightly. Both the VIX cash number and the July future are sitting right around 25. So 25 is a, a strike that is in play right now and it's about the only July strike in play. The, that July 25 straddle, buying the call, buying the put, going for about 75 cents right now. So the market is implying that they don't expect much of a move on tomorrow's opening print at all. They expect to print right around 25. Uh, that straddle went out into yesterday's close worth a dollar seventeen and it's just been trickling into 75 cents throughout the trading day today. Most of the trading continues to be August, September, and beyond. We've had a buyer of 6,000 August 25 puts, paying 80 cents. And the interesting action in the back months is volatility levels continue to come in there. Someone is selling the November 30 straddle for eight dollars and a quarter and then eight dollars and twenty cents. If you remember last week we had somebody selling a November strangle, the 2240 strangle. So both of these orders have a big impact on volatility not only in October but also November and December. Uh, so this has only traded about three thousand times but they're offered out at 820 on it and that's putting a ceiling on all of back month volatility. Uh, so that's one of a big market moving order, people predicting less movement in VIX options over the late summer and fall months. This is Jamie Tyrrell with Group One, Option Monster. Check back for tomorrow's settlement.